Okay, and out she goes. She's going over to him. He's been given the big call with the food. She's got the eggs where she wants them. He's called about four times, so he should be sailing in here to take over on the eggs. Because it's chilly. It's 40-some degrees. We've got a little breeze. So we'll see what happens here. A flock of geese going over. Shouldn't be just a little bit and he will be sailing in here. I'll hang in here as long as I can because that's the routine. Well, she's having breakfast then with whatever he brought her. The male will take over on the eggs. Because they're right, they're incubating every day now. I got to keep them at 98.6. And it's a little cool. We have a breeze and it's 40 degrees. Okay, the male's sailing in now. And back in. Now take care of the eggs and keep them warm. Until she's done with the breakfast. So he does his part and he's a great hunter. As the incubation goes on the days, he brings in all the food or leaves her just like he did here. Then uh, after they incubate for 35 days and they hatch, he'll be bringing food for her to feed the youngsters. And the bigger they get, the more food he has to bring. So. Right in the middle of it, he'll be feeding himself, her, and five youngsters. And that's how it goes at the Cooper Hawk Nest. And we're down by the Eagle View Park, Kent, Washington. And out again we go. So we got some activity there. We'll see how long it is before the next one comes back. They get all excited about it. Breakfast time at the Cooper Hawk Nest. I heard him come in and he was given the big, big call several times and she slowly got adjusted to where she could sail out and come in had the little relief on the nest everything looked okay and sailed back out now we'll see how long it takes for one of them to come back in here she's been sitting tight all morning the eggs are plenty warm they're right at 98.6 now so it'll take a while for them to cool down they can get off them for a little bit we'll see what happens but that'll be the routine until the eggs hatch and they'll be giving her that signal when it's breakfast time All right, well, I think we're going to call that pretty much good. And we'll wait for uh, one of them to come in here. I'll give it just a little bit longer. Just a few seconds more. Then I'll have to shut it off and start with another video. All right, well, we'll wait till they land in there. <laughs> 